What's up? It's Jess here. I wanted to share with you a quick video and this video is going to be really helpful in getting higher click-through rates on your blog posts. If you post those blogs onto Facebook or other different media platforms such as oh, Twitter or Google+, um, same kind of system applies that if you use these images, and I'm going to show you how in just a moment, that you will have a higher click-through rate rather than just using a link. So guys, really important, links don't work. So make sure that for your audience, your readers, whoever you're trying to attract, that it is very visual for them because without the visual stimulation, you know, they're not going to be as likely to click through. So real quick, this is my blog. It's a simple, beautiful blog. I like it just because it's so simple. Um, and this particular blogging platform is great because it has no complicated anything. It's very user friendly. And there's also an app that you can get for this blog. So no matter where you are, you can always be in touch with uh, your followers. So if you were, say, out on the lake for the day, you could shoot a quick video and type up a title and post that blog and it would be out there and accessible to everyone. So I just thought that was great. And I don't think there's any others that are out there like that, at least not in this price range. So that's a really, really good deal. Um, this is the blog that I did today, okay? So I have my video here, and I've also got my write-up, my uh, summary. Now, uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take the first couple, you could take the first paragraph, the second paragraph, just find some kind of great line, a catchy line that will pull your audience in, your readers, that they can relate to and want to read more. So actually the best one that I like is this third one. I like the first and the third because they kind of give you an idea of what the blog is about, but they also create imagery. And imagery is really important for your readers because, and it's important for your blog too, and I'll tell you why in just a minute. So all I do is I copy this, come back over here, and I'm going to paste that in. So it's a little lengthy. I'm going to take out this middle paragraph so it's not so long. And I'm going to keep spaces in there because spaces are good. So this second paragraph is my favorite now because it says, bringing in the dough by the bucket loads. And right away, I think buckets of cash. I think that's what my mind sees. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to find a great photo image of, show you how to do it, it's so easy, buckets of cash, <laughs> and uh, click the images there, so you get lots and lots of photos of buckets of cash. I am seeing mostly just that one, that's a cute one. See all kinds of different options pop up for you. And you know what, I think I'll just go with that one at the top where there was a whole bunch of them. Yeah, because it gets further away from your topic at hand the further you go down, I think. So this one's fine, see? Um, it gets the message across. So I'll go ahead and click on that one, enlarge it. And what you need to do next is just simply right click and then save your image as. And it'll ask you if you want to rename it, this is your time to do that, or if you want to stick it in a different folder, I'm going to keep it as is and save like it is. So then when I see that little arrow and that thing bounce down in my documents, I know it's in. And I'm going to click back over here, um, upload. Now, you know what else you can do? If you don't want to do photos all the time, you can also do your video. So my video is here. It's also here on YouTube. So this YouTube URL up here is the one you would want to put if you weren't doing the photo, if you were indeed going to do a video instead. So I actually switch it up. I'll do both sometimes. Today is just the photo day, so I'm going with that. Uh, browse selection, and then this is in alphabetical order, and there it is, buckets of money. Open that up. There it is, buckets of money, JPG, post it. Oh shucks, you know what? I forgot one of the most important parts of putting this out there. And the most important part of putting this out there, I'm going to have to edit this here in a minute. 
let me go ahead and I'm going to say, I guess, edit. Okay. No, that's not what I want. So what I did wrong here, what I left out, you guys probably already know because it's a really easy mistake, but all you need to do is put in at the very beginning is where I like to put in the rest of your blog needs to go somewhere because this is only part of it and your readers want to read the entirety. They want to read the rest of your blog, get the idea, and that, my friends, is where you will capture them, whether it's their emails or if you're signing them up for something, your splash page, capture page, whatever it is, that's what you want to put right here. So in my case, can I really not just come on in here and... Huh. It looks like not, so I'll have to fix this later. But what I'm going to show you, I'm just going to put in this box. Um, you know, I might just redo this real quick. You guys just have a minute, right? It's just going to take a second. Watch how fast this is. And then I'm going to put my photo video. Browse. I'm going to go over it again so that way you, you get the double, double whammy. Okay, so I'm going to take that down a couple spaces. And I'm going to put my link here. Now this link, like I said, it's going to take you to my blog so you can read the rest of it. Okay. Now there it is. So instead of putting this URL in, because this is just my really general term URL, I'm not going to put that one in because that will bring me to my main page. Now, if it was an old video or something, you wouldn't want to use this because they'd be like, where did that video go? And they'd have to scroll down and try and find your video. So you want to go ahead and click on whatever video it is that you're going to put that link in. So this is the one. So click on that title and now it brings it up. See that? That's the one you want. So you copy and paste that. And that's what you put up there. Easy. Nice. Okay, so I'm going to post this and we can get a look at it. We already kind of know what it's going to look like because of this one. There it is. So, there you have it, guys. I hope that has been helpful and have a great day. Bye!